Let's begin with a word of prayer and we'll move right along into today's lesson. We thank you, Lord, for this time we have to learn and grow. We seek to do the best we can and add to what we know. We love you, God, with all our hearts and to others' love we show. Pleasing you is our goal, not to our lesson we should go. In Jesus' name, amen. I believe in Jesus Christ, the Messiah who died and was resurrected from the dead to save humanity from sins. He is my Lord, Master, Boss, and Savior. I love God, I love myself, and I love others with the God kind of love. I believe the Bible is inspired by the Spirit of God and is the basis for morality, rights, and wrongs. I look to the Spirit of God to understand God's intent behind every letter of the Bible. I abide by this intent, and I live to honor God in thought, in word, and in deed. I believe there is a heaven to gain and a hell to shun. Father, please give me grace and mercy to please you more. This is my morality creed. In the name of Jesus, amen. Hi, this is Theta here with Hero Smart Homeschool Academy. Welcome to class. It's good to have you here. We are in Unit Five, which is the last unit, and inside this workbook, if you if you're working through the Godly Learners Mathematics Grade Two workbook, and Unit Five is titled Everyday Statistics. Not only is this the final unit, but this is actually the final chapter, and it is the final week. So, good job if you've been coming along and working along with me. We are in Lesson One Hundred Seventy Six. And the title of this lesson is Counting Columns. Now, when you're working through statistics, what you're just trying to do is find out statistics. Start with an overall number and find out a percentage and um, a percentage of that number that is doing something different than everything else. So let me give you an example of that. Here we have, if you have your workbook, you can just pull it out. But for those who don't, you can look at this. This is what it says. Here are some toys. You have a monkey, some hippos, a lion, a giraffe. They've been put in columns to compare amounts. How many more monkeys are there than hippos? So we know that we have some hippos there. We have some monkeys. What we need to do is count the total number of monkeys and the total number of hippos. And then we will find out how many more monkeys there are than hippos. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six hippos. There are six monkeys. Then you can count the number of hippos. One, two, three. There are only three hippos. How many more monkeys are there than hippos? There are six minus three more. Six minus three is three. There are three more monkeys than there are hippos. Let's try question two. How many giraffes are there? Well, let's count the number of giraffes. One, two, three, four, five. There are five giraffes. Question number uh, three, the final question. How many more monkeys are there than lions? Well, we've determined that there are six monkeys. Now, let's count the number of lions and determine the difference. One, two, three, four. There are four lions. There are six monkeys. There are six minus four is two. There are two more monkeys than there are lions. So as you can see, statistics is just a function of finding out the total number of something you're looking at and trying to find out, hey, what is the difference? What is the percentage? In the future, you'll be working with statistics with respect to it could get really complex. But for now, just find out, hey, if there are six monkeys, how many more monkeys are there than hippos? Finding out a little bits of information like that can help you build, a, build data and you can use that data to do a lot of uh, do a lot of things. Okay, so um, so if you have your workbook, take time to complete the other activities on that page to give you a chance to become even more familiar with everyday statistics. Thank you so much for coming to class for being a part of today's lesson. Until next time, remember Jesus loves you, and so do we. God bless.
I'll be your hero's body And as you study With heroes born I will be your friend So don't you worry